what's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my youtube channel today i'm gonna basically tell you how to fix crashing or freezing issues or lagging issues in dying light 2 so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you will properly know what to do in order to fix this issue before we start right into the video, I just want to you guys know, let you guys know that I would really, really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment, or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me, guys. You would support my work in YouTube a little bit, and I'm gonna really, really be thankful for that. So uh, either way, I hope you guys have so I hope you guys are left a subscription, and let's get right started. So uh, as a first step, I would recommend you to start your task manager by right-clicking your taskbar and opening up your task manager. What I want you to do next is gonna be uh, really simple: just navigate to the top left corner of your screen and ensure that you're sticking around processes. Uh, the next st step will be a little bit um, strange, but let me explain. So I want you to simply end every single task by just right clicking and then clicking on to end task, um, which is currently running in the background or as an application. Let's, let me explain. So two reasons for that. First of all, uh, too many applications, too many background processes running at the same time could cause these kind of issues so lagging freezing or crashing especially in low-end or bad pcs and the other reason like it was for me there are some applications some programs some background processes which are currently just third parting your main game causing it to crash or to freeze in some way don't ask me why but it's happening so just avoid this problem by just ending every single task yeah guys uh once you finish just click on to end your task manager and as the next step i want you to click onto a random spot on your desktop it's just simply an empty spot by right clicking and clicking onto display settings and um what i want you to do next is simply just click onto display and stick around that and uh identify what your main monitor is so click onto identify and obviously this just applies if you have more than one monitor once it is identified scroll down and stick around scale and layout well, i want you to change the size of text steps and other items to 100 percent as recommended and your display resolution should be the same as in game so uh for example if you have in game like 1720 by 1070 you should also apply this to your display resolution so once you're finished just simply end the task and navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen again open up your uh, settings and navigate right into update and security stick around windows update i know guys it's going to sound a little bit basic but trust me updating every single driver you could possibly update on your pc will help you a lot with like 99 percent of your technical issues you're currently having and updating your windows driver will help you a lot with your crashing lagging or freezing issues in general so just update your driver download it and provide the best possible performance for your PC. So once you're finished, just simply end this task and do the same thing for a graphics card. So just simply download the latest version of that, providing your best possible performance for your PC. It will help you a lot. And yeah, guys, that's it for the video. I hope I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm really sorry if you couldn't, guys, but I'm just gonna do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.